Hi, I'm Rabbi Michelle Fisher. I'm the Executive Director of the Hillel at MIT. I'm both a scientist and a rabbi. Both my undergraduate and my graduate studies were in organic chemistry before I decided to switch my career slightly and go to rabbinical school. I never saw a conflict between science and religion. When I was working in lab, I saw the beauty of God's handiwork every day in the natural product synthesis that I was doing. The intricacies of how molecules, compounds fit together, natural products were made and could be recreated in lab, or how the processes of photosynthesis, respiration, all worked in specific ways inspired awe in me, and I saw it as God's paintbrush. Maimonides, who is both a rabbi and a doctor, teaches that science is a path to learning the love and fear of God. My personal perspective reflects the, law, the love and the appreciation on one hand, and awe and fear at the power we human beings have to create or destroy. So while science gives me an appreciation for God and for religion, religion also gives me, among other things, an ethical framework for considering our scientific work. There are many things that we are capable of doing with our engineering, with our scientific discoveries. And no amount of science will teach us what we should do and how we should use those products. Religion and Judaism reminds me that life is not black and white. In the laboratory, in the engineering world, it's very important that there are blacks and whites. If someone's building a bridge, it is vitally important the engineer says it'll take 50 tons, it doesn't collapse after two tons of truck go over it. And in building the Hubble Space Telescope, the fact that C is a constant is vitally important. But the real life of human interactions, of experimental play in the world becomes gray and religion teaches us responsibility for that which we create. Further, both science and Jewish thought teach that the world is understandable by human beings. We believe that the Torah and Jewish tradition is to be studied, is understandable, was given over to human beings with human minds to comprehend. And similarly, the laws of nature can also be studied and understood. Learning more about how the world is put together and at the same time what our roles are as human beings in this world are parallel and equally important acts for each one of us.